Okay guys, hi, uh, welcome back to another video, so, on to another inbox review on a kit that I saw another inbox review on and I had to get it, so, yeah, uh, new tool Fix 148 Horror, Horror Cannon Mark 1, it's the Battle of Britain 70th anniversary, 7, 75th, sorry, anniversary kit and there's a little story there sort of thing of a uh, pilot mckenzie uh uses wingtip of a hurricane to knock off the tail of the mesh smit bear from a nine uh and he successfully made it back to base so good on him probably out of ammo or something so yeah decided to ram him <laughs> so on the side we have Pictures of the built model and cartograph decals. Uh, so, yeah, finish of the finished model, just not painted. We have on the side just the same. Um, the kit number is A O five one two seven. So, yep. And on the top, we've got two flying hours. Uh, skill level two. I was actually expecting it to be free for some reason, but uh, and you've got two variants, uh, both for Hurricane Mark One. One's this pilot who got the motor tip off, and the other one is uh, Peter Vacher, some random name. So yeah, and just some the usual ethics club stuff on the back so yeah so we have inside the box we'll do probably the instructions first yeah and the decals are for the instructions yeah so I'm just gonna put that there so we can focus on something So we have the instructions here. Uh, so first of all, we have the cockpit going in, and the uh, seats. And this kit has quite a lot of cockpit detail. Like you've got all the framework going around, and all the spars in the wings. Hope they're not like the uh, Lancaster uh, spots because they were terrible. It took like ages to sand them down. So, yeah, hopefully they are okay. Mm -hmm. Cockpit going into place, lots of framework and everything. Uh, pretty nice, very detailed. Uh, we have the pilot. He's looking a bit uh, goofy. Where is he? There. Look a bit weird. Oh well. I'm just gonna put this here and I'm gonna put it on top so the uh, camera doesn't go weird. So. I'm not sure. So. so you've got the cockpit going in, putting it on the wings, and you're attaching all this sea area to the wings, the bottom of the wings. Uh, so you, now you've got the option to cut out the uh, some panels in the wings for the uh, gun bays. Now here I've got some nice, I think 7.7 .7 machine guns. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. So you've got some of them going in. So, and some ammo boxes by the looks of it. So yeah, very nice guns. Very nice gun detail in the wings. Wings going on, you've either got the wings all sealed up or you've got the ones with all of the uh, panels off so you can see the guns. You've got the instrument panel, or looks a bit going in, the decal on, no glass, you've got some decals going on the side wall detail here, so that's nice. And you've got the fuselage going on. So this kit looking very well detailed so far. Here we've got just 
finished all the panels on the bottom going on and we've got flaps and everything there oh is that actually in the kit i had a look and there's two of these so one has an arrestor hook so i think one of them is for the sea hurricane i think uh, so you've got the horizontal stabilizers and the rudder going in all of the uh, I think they're intakes exhausts well. you've got all your wheels option wheels are pulled down you've got the prop which is in quite a few stages actually uh, exhaust going on gun sight and the last page canopy and whatever you want these so yeah uh, and you've got all the little lights going in as well so instructions new epic instructions so they're amazing so and on the front you've got all of your like information on the uh, hurricane and it does mention the sea hurricane at the bottom here so yep uh, you've got all your assembly instructions and your assembly uh, icons on here we have the option, all the colour options, colour sheets. Uh, so you've got William McKenzie there, and I think Peter Vatcher on here. I think they're both the, the same colour scheme, by the looks of it. Yeah, exactly the same paint job. So. Uh, just a different serial number, probably in the same squadron. So not Can't be. No, different air filled, so yep. Yeah. See instructions. Now on to the decals. So, decals, cartograph, and they look really nice. Um, not many stencils as on usual Airfix kits. There's usually like loads on. New ones, but yeah, not that many. I was expecting more anyway. More decals on that. So now we've got screws. So first sprue, I think it's sprue C. So here we have the both of the uh, uh, different types of tail. That's on the wrist hook. I'm imagining so they can bring out another variant. So yeah. I guess they're uh, definitely bringing in another variant. You've got the two props there, and these have no absolute flash on. Fuse large, uh, quite soft plastic as well, and you've got all of the uh, like uh, what would you call it? Stress marks? Uh, no, um, like where the panels are, I guess. Uh, where the as are. You've got the horizontal stabilizers. And it's just the little front of the plane which goes there. So, yep. Now, onto this sprue, sprue D. Lots of small detail parts like prop wheels, uh, all that kind of thing, instrument panel. So, this one quite cluttered, and I think here we've got another variant. Uh, which looks, I think, like the tropical version with the uh, big intake. I'm not too sure if that's on the normal one. No, I don't think it is. So, yeah. Now we've got all of the uh, wing spars here and the bottom of the wings. So, gear doors and all the wheels and stuff. So. Oh, that's the rudder. Uh, I think this is the last sprue. Hold on. Yeah, last sprue. Just the wings and uh, I think flaps and stuff. Not flaps. I think they go on the uh, horizontal stabilizers. But yeah. Top of the wings, there, there's where you can obviously put it out there. And you've got all of your. Uh, I think that's like the back of the seat, the bulkhead and everything, so, yep. So that's all the sprues. Really uh, nice, no flash at all, so, 
looks like it's going to fit well. It's got the clear parts. So, really nice by the looks of it. Uh, no problems with that. I think we've got one canopy smaller than the other, I think. So, it's a bit different. And yeah, really nice clear canopies. So, it's nice to see. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Inbox review on this kit. Very nice. Uh, looking forward to build this one, actually. Uh, I have got the can you get it oh it's in the back don't know uh, the 172 one airfix one so yeah might build that alongside i don't know so, thanks for watching guys 148 girl i uh, recommend this kit i think it goes for about 17 16 pound i think I'm not sure what it is in other currencies but yeah uh, £17, £16. Pound. So, yep. Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys next time.